I'm going to teach you something amazing and simple. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to make something, but before we get started, I just want to touch base on something. I understand a lot of you are foodies or food lovers, and you probably have your own food blogs. But if you don't, uh, an opportunity came across my desk to collaborate with a bunch of other food channels and Squarespace.com, a place to create your own websites professionally and simply. And so I thought this was a great opportunity for both me and you, for me to collaborate with a bunch of other food channels and for you to create a food blog if you're interested in it. So if you're interested in getting a food blog, then you can get a free trial and 10% off by going to squarespace.com slash food and you enter your promo code, which is food. And there'll be a link in the description below. Now, basically what I'm gonna be doing with these other food channels is changing the motto of Squarespace from a better website starts with you to a better website starts with your food. And we're all just gonna create videos just uh, about simple stuff or inspired by Squarespace. So this is gonna be my video, I'm gonna get going now. And at the end of this video, you can check out all their other videos by clicking on the link at the end. Of the video. Okay, so let's get going, let's go. Okay, so you start off by taking a bunch of chilies and just removing them because you only need one. Okay, so you cut it in half, but leaving on the stalk and the top part of it. And then you just turn it and cut that in half again. And that will leave you with four pieces and all connected to the top part still of the chili. Okay. So now what you want to do is you want to take a very sharp knife and drag just the tip of it through each of these four parts you just cut to cut them again in half to create eight sort of petals. And you have to be very careful not to damage the other ones or cut through the inner parts of the chili. So drag it through very carefully and very precisely. Okay, so there we go. That's all of them cut. And now you just take this and you put it into ice cold water. Just like this. And this is gonna take about 30 to 40 minutes to happen. So here we're just gonna fast forward now. Okay, and what's gonna happen is the water is gonna enter the inner chili cells and they're gonna engorge with water and expand. But the skin is gonna remain the same. So this pushes the leaves outwards or the petals outwards, just like this. And what you're seeing takes literally 30 to 40 minutes. Okay, so once it's done, that's basically it. The fire bloom is done. And then you literally just pull it out of the water and just put it to one side. Now, I called it a fire bloom because I asked my Facebook fans what they thought it should be called and the highest voted suggestion was fire bloom made by Panmata Von Blade. Uh, thank you very much, Panmata. I really appreciate your input. And if you guys want to also vote something up next time or see photos before the video comes out, then go like the Facebook page. You can check it out by searching Make Sushi One on Facebook. Okay, so this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed this very short, quick tutorial. Um, one little tip is do not touch your face or hands or anything up here once you've cut the chins because it will burn. Okay, now, um, with what I said before in mind, I was thinking a lot of you probably have food blogs already and if you do, I would love to look at them or see them or just check them out. So write down below the link to your food blog if you have one. If you don't, then don't worry. Um, maybe write down the link to the food blog you love the most. Um, just state that it isn't your one if it isn't yours. Okay. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and see you next week. Oh wait, 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 wait. Hold it, hold it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking on the top left corner of your screen. And last but not least, check out all my other videos by clicking on the right. Okay, thanks for watching. See you guys next week. <laughs>